Austin, Texas. Steve, I'd like to hear your segment. Can you give us an understanding about what kinds of things the cataract surgeon should be looking for and testing for? Somebody that you in the cornea and your retina act people because look at every slice. Not color that wheel is on. Them. So that, in short, OCT and everybody. For engaging additional care or additional workup perioperatively, um, other pathology, cataract surgeon and the patient. It can happen afterwards, but there's one or the other. I personally, it's just more complicated and get the axial length right. Point, Steve. Uh, I want to also discuss some other um, posterior testing technologies, such as uh, forcing angiography or uh, multifocal ERG. Suffices. Mm -hmm. I, I'd been so with laser autofluorescence, like on the Heidelberg, and I'm not a consultant mm -hmm. for Heidelberg. That is really effective technology. Like uh, a couple other finer points here. I, I know that this goes a little bit beyond our scope here, but if I can just pick your brain for a moment, there's been kind of a some studies it's about the data and uh, it's out there. My macrodema. Why are there? Mm -hmm. You don't have a higher incidence of inflammatory. The opposite. Just like people think, epi in your skull. <laughs> that, that, that's a, a nice aphorism to, to, to pass on. Again, Steve, I appreciate your, your being here.